Hi YouTube, my name is Connor from Hostseed, and today I'll be showing you how to use the FileZilla FTP client. Um, FTP is basically a protocol which allows you to upload and download and modify files on a remote server from your desktop or from a website. So first thing you want to do is open Hostseed.com and go to Multicraft. There's a button in the upper right hand corner here. So click that and then you want to log in. Now I'll just log in using my test information. So that's uh, Connor test. And here is my very popular Minecraft server with zero players on it. So to find your FTP details, you need to go to files, at FTP file access here. And this is what you need to enter in the in the FileZilla client. So open FileZilla, click on the site manager button and you want to add a new site. So I'll call this one my lonely Minecraft server. I spelled it. Alright, so I'll copy the host there. And the port is port 21. It's not the same as your Minecraft server itself. It's the FTP port, which is different from your Minecraft port. So be sure you enter port 21. And that's the same on all servers on our systems. Alright, an FTP username is connortest.102 and it's login type normal there. So uh, have your username and then put your, your password, whatever that may be. And then you can click connect or OK. And I'll just click OK so I can show you how to go back to this. Alright, um, so to open a safe connection, um, hit this arrow and click on your server name there. And Alright, so now it connects and it should show all files on your server in the right hand pane here, which is um, the remote server pane. Um, in the left hand side is the structure of your computer and it has uh, your files, you can see documents, downloads, Dropbox, and stuff there. Alright, uh, so first, let's say I want to edit my server properties. So right click, view slash edit. It'll open probably Notepad by default on most of your computers, but I have it set up to use a different editor, which I prefer. So that'll take just a second to open up here. Okay, so now I see that the server properties is open, and we can see the contents of the file. Um, so let's say I want to change the difficulty to peaceful or easy. Go and hit file save or whatever the equivalent is in your place, and go back to FileZilla. It says the file has changed, it sees that you saved a file and then asks if you want to put it back on the server, which in this case I don't, but you probably would. So I'll hit yes, but I'll hit no for now. I'm going to upload files, simply drag them from your computer or from the left hand pane onto your server and to download files, drag them from your server to your to your computer's pane. So for example, if I wanted to download my netherworld, I could drag and drop it onto my desktop here. And then you can watch the progress here, which I don't actually need it, so I'll right click on the server name and hit stop and remove all, which will cancel the download. And there we go. Say I wanted to upload a plugin. Download it and let's look at Anti Grief, which is uh, written by Zach, who is also a, a support guy and is he's a pretty cool guy around host seed. And I want to download the jar here. Yep, so I'll copy this and put it on my desktop. Now that it's there, you can right click in FileZilla and hit refresh, and that now shows that the jar is on your desktop. So now I'll, I'll take out that ugly one from it because I already ran through this once. Now, to upload, just uh, drag and drop this um, into your plugins folder on your server. Let's say drag it there, and now you see that I've uploaded the file. Alright, so that's about it. If you have any questions or comments, uh, leave a comment down below. 
um, make a ticket or ask on live chat and we'll try and get to you. That's about it. Have a good day.